Hi, this is Carlos with House of Tennis and in this video we will use a hand-fed drill to improve the technique of the power-to-power -power forehand, which is the ideal way to handle wide balls coming with power. The first step is to have the player recognize the pace and the direction of the incoming ball in order to set the feet properly to execute a power-to-power -power forehand. Feed wide balls across your body with some pace to the player's forehand side and have them focusing on turning the shoulders and hip to the side by, use, by using the non-dominant arm across their body while getting the racket out to the side. The dominant elbow should always be slightly bent and away from the body in order to create good leverage on the swing pass. Have the player moving wide to the side and remind the player to keep a short and compact swing in order to absorb the pace on the incoming ball properly. A compact racket takeback will allow the player to neutralize the incoming power with power by pressing through the shot with a firm contact. Long swing pads when dealing with incoming balls with power will cause miss hits or off balance forehands. After tracking down the ball correctly with a short compact swing, remind the player to put the weight on the outside leg while keeping the upper body straight and balanced in order to absorb the power of the incoming ball. It's very important to coordinate the hip rotation with the point of contact with a compact swing in order to obtain a smooth and synchronized stroke where the arm, body, and legs are working together in harmony. Have the player focus on finishing the stroke with solid balance. This, this means upper body straight, knees slightly bent, and the head still while making contact with the ball. Even though the racket takeback should be compact, the follow through needs to be smooth where the dominant hand is relaxed to avoid any unnecessary tension on this stroke. 